Brazil is one of the top producers and exporters of meat products in the world, and there are over 2.6 million cattle farms located around the country. In the center west region lies one farm that has started to do things a little differently. San Marcelo Ranchers has decided to put strong animal welfare, social and environmental principles at the core of its business. And the reason for this approach? Simply put, animal welfare has a direct impact on meat quality and the productivity of a farm. Well-managed extensive cattle farms and good animal welfare can bring major benefits to producers, farm workers, consumers and the environment. Unfortunately, not all farms are like this. Extensive beef systems, which are common in Brazil, can be extremely efficient. However, the soil and pasture land management implemented in these farms can have significant impacts on productivity, animal health and welfare, and the environment. Handling animals in a stressful manner can result in weight reduction, meat downgrades, and losses. In beef cattle, this can result in the loss of up to half a kilogram of meat in 70% of the animals. For San Marcelo, this would equate to a loss of around 12,000 kilograms of meat annually. Meat which could feed more than 400 people with 30 kilograms of beef a year. Additionally, it is estimated that in the Amazon region alone, more than 50 million hectares of forest have been converted into pasture and approximately half of this area is in some stage of degradation. Fortunately, this is something that producers, retailers and consumers are starting to notice. Consumers in Brazil are increasingly concerned with the food they eat and are asking for meat produced with the environment, animal welfare and food safety in mind. O bem-estar animal, eu acho que é uma tendência nova para o consumidor, que agora está tendo mais acesso às informações, está questionando mais sobre isso. Com certeza, essas questões são questões que vieram para ficar e aumentar de importância para o consumidor. To respond to this demand, retailers know they need to stock meat products that come from responsible sources, where the animals have been treated well and don't receive preventative antibiotics. Increasingly, farms are seeing that there is a benefit in improving their environmental and animal welfare practices. At San Marcelo, thanks to new farming techniques, they are seeing a big difference. Beef cattle are more productive, thanks to good pasture management, diet supplementation in the dry season, improvements to the genetic potential, and the implementation of an animal welfare plan to reduce stress and meat loss. Fazenda São Marcelo ela é diferente das outras fazendas e granjas no Brasil porque há uma preocupação muito grande com o bem-estar animal. Você percebe que as pessoas que manejam esses animais são capacitadas para esse manejo, se preocupando em manejar, utilizando boas práticas. Aqui, depois que nós começamos a utilizar essas técnicas de trabalho, reduziu um pouco de acidente de, em causa de quebrador de animal. Você manejava o um animal com violência, batendo, corria risco de machucar o funcionário e o animal também. E, os, e, e traz um resultado bom em termos de, de acabamento de, da carne. Se não, não, não vê hematoma de carne, não vai bater. No Ranchers like San Marcelo show us that well-managed extensive grazing systems and good animal welfare can bring major benefits to producers, the local economy, the environment and consumers.